This Sooth clone just came across my radar and it's an absolute beast. So let's head over to Ableton and check this thing out. This plugin is called Boba, just like the tea. In fact, I think that's what this cat is drinking right now. And just like Soothe, this is a dynamic resonance suppressor, meaning that it can be used to remove harshness, clean up muddiness, and even balance out tones from any track that you put it on. And there is some really juicy functionality I can't wait to show you guys, but first let's go over the basics. This depth knob is the amount of compression and effects that's being applied past the certain threshold. You can think of this kind of like the ratio on a compressor and not like a dryer wet. The threshold is the value at which the compression will start to affect the peaks and resonance of the sound. And when you start cranking this thing up, you're gonna notice it's gonna start using a lot of CPU and it might even start lagging, but it's kind of cool that they give us the option to go that crazy with it anyways. Also, if you have your info view open and you hover over these different knobs, it's going to give you a well written out description so you can learn a little more about it and understand exactly what you're doing with each metric. And obviously we have our attack and release and this behaves like any other plugin. I'm sure you've seen this a million times and this is awesome. You have a lot of control over the frequency response using this built in EQ so you can roll off the highs or the lows and you have three bands in the middle if you want to boost or reduce the bell curves. And if you want to boost the entire levels, if you grab it from the left hand side right here and pull it up, it's going to boost the entire thing. Now let's jump into some of the more juicy functionality. One thing I love is that you have the option to put this into mid side mode or the regular left and right stereo mode. And one cool thing you could do is put this into a group by pressing command G or control G on Windows. You could go ahead and duplicate this effect. And then you can go ahead and process the mid side or the left and right completely separate from one another. You can get some really crazy results doing this. And this link functionality right here either allows this processing to affect the left and right side together if it's up at 100%, i.e. linking them together. Or if you put this down to 0%, it's going to process each side individually, right? Moving over to the side chain, by default, it's doing an internal side chain. But if you want to have an external source do that, you just go ahead and click this and it's going to be external. Then you can go down here to the settings icon and actually pick what you want to do the side chaining. You could even use this to side chain your kick and 808 together. And you can even solo just what's being sidechained or this triangle is the delta so you can hear the resonance frequency that's being reduced in the mix and that allows you to get even more precise with how you want to mix and process the signal. Just a heads up, this is a Max for Live plugin. I believe that requires you to have Ableton Suite license. But if you have it, you can go ahead to this link and you can download it here. I'm going to leave that in the description below if you guys want to check it out. It is free, so you don't have to pay anything to get it. But if you have a couple dollars, it would help support the content creator. And man, this thing is absolutely amazing. So definitely worth a couple bucks if you can spare. This might not have the exact same functionality as Soothe, but it's pretty dang close. And for that price point and the fact that it works right in Ableton without having to open up another view, honestly, kills Soothe too, in my opinion. So thank you guys so much for watching this. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and smash that like button. We upload videos like this all the time and we'd love to have you in the gang. Besides that one, man, have a lovely day and we'll catch you in the next one. Peace.